Well, good Saturday morning to you folks. I hope you had a great night's rest. I hope you're ready to face today, whatever it's going to hold for you. Uh, hopefully a little bit of rest. Got a busy day tomorrow with church. Got a funeral tomorrow afternoon, then church tomorrow night. So hopefully we get a rest a little bit. But um, chapter 13 of the book of Hebrews. Verse 1, let brotherly love continue. Verse 2. Be not forgetful to entertain strangers, for thereby some have entertained angels unawares. I don't know about you. I don't know how you look at this. Some people find that spooky um, or maybe they don't really know how, how to take it. I want to look at it as this exactly he said be careful to entertain them uh, there are people that you may come in contact with that you may have never seen and maybe you will never ever see again sometimes it is those people who can give you the best advice who can help you in a time of need and maybe you don't even consider that it is even at the hand of God that is moving on them to tell you until later um, but whatever it is it's important for us to be kind because that should be our nature as Christians is to be kind to others but not just to be kind oh wait a minute this might be an angel I better be kind to them not not just because of that <laughs> but what if God sent somebody your way to help you out in a time of great need or distress and you were mean to them, rude to them, crude to them because you thought they, they didn't have anything to offer you that would help you. It's important. It's important that we are kind and loving and generous and if you're not careful, you can get caught up in things of this life and and my lands. It can it can send you in a whirl. Your mind can stay running uh, in gear even when you're trying to sleep at night. You just you have to ask God for help, for peace, for direction, for strength. But let me say to you today, even some of those people that maybe you have known for years, God may have placed them in your life so they can be of help to you. They can be of an encouragement to you. Maybe they're family. Maybe they're just friends. Maybe they're people that you attend church with. And that would be a blessing, wouldn't it? That people you attend church with would be the very people that God used to lift your burden or help carry your burden. And that's what verse 1 says, let brotherly love continue there's no place for it to stop there's no place for us to take a break from it let it continue I've sang this song I don't know how many times um, someone out there could tell me if they wanted to but I'm going to sing it again I was troubled in my mind and had reached my darkest time with my life and my spirit was low I walked out on a span of a bridge made by man and looked down at the water so cold I stood shivering there on the edge of despair, knowing well I was going to fall. With the end drawn near, I had no mortal fear. I had God 
Lord, I thank you for uh, the opportunity uh, to rest, to slow down long enough to, to listen to what people say to us, to receive encouragement at the hands of others. And God, I don't know if they're angels. Even the people that I come in contact with that I don't know that that maybe there are folks and God, you know where I go and what I do and the things that I see and the people that I see and even in facilities where it seems like that the people, some of them don't even know their own names. They don't know um, their children. They wouldn't know their husband if they saw them. But sometimes that music will bring a smile out in them or Maybe even sometimes a tear. God, sometimes those things are such an encouragement to see um, that even when it seems as if our mind is gone, what we have put in there, what you have planted in us, God, you bring back again. That's um, still a miracle to me, Lord. I pray that you would bless all those that hear this. I know that there are people that are hurting and God, I pray for those people that are not well today, that you would encourage them, strengthen them, help them, Lord. Uh, God, I pray that you would give the help and strength that is needed in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you, folks. I pray that you have a great day, and I will see you. If you'll watch Sunday, you'll see us, but if not, I'll see you back Monday. God bless.